This prompt generator is not only gonna create AI image prompts, it's gonna create any sort of prompt you want for any single category imaginable. You'll never need prompts again. Have you ever struggled with prompting? Yes, I know I have. How about writer's block or brain freeze from creativity? Whether you're just starting out or a prompting pro, we've all been there. But today, you're at the right place. Why is that, Eric? Because today, I'm gonna show you how to create an amazing AI image prompt. Generate amazing prompts based off of all of this information. Specific Specifically, what you see on a web page. You can even take a Wikipedia page like I did here and create this image. So I'll show you some amazing tips to create prompts for anything that you're looking at on a web page. But make sure you stick around because after I show you these two tips, you're definitely gonna wanna see this new prompt generator I'm also gonna share with you today. Anything you want, this prompt is gonna do it all for you. Check the links in the description for the ultimate prompts databases. The first thing you need to do is first visit a specific web page that you're interested in. Now, this prompt will vary based on the web page you're on, but let me give you a very unique and good example. The first thing you do is once you have your URL copied, find your web page. In this case, I would highly recommend this URL right here. And the page you're looking at right now is gonna be Runway ML's help page. What it does is that it's gonna give me all these examples and how to's on how to structure specific prompts to get the best kind of styles for AI videos. But the reason why this one will be so helpful for you is because the same prompts can work for AI videos as they do for AI images. Now keep in mind, any URL can work. Basically, any sort of URL that's gonna have like a how-to guide on how to actually prompt the right way. Okay, so I have that URL copied. Now the next thing you wanna do is come over here into ChatGPT. Just type in, what is this page about? Okay, question mark. And now what you wanna do is after the question mark, go ahead now, paste in, that URL and watch this magic start to happen. Now it's searching the web. You wanna make sure that the LLM you use has that capacity. And basically it's just giving you a breakdown of this first paragraph. Now this does nothing for you, but now this next step is really gonna take things to the next level. You're gonna simply ask this question. Based off of that page, can you please provide me with an example prompt? So it's gonna look just like this. There it is pasted at the bottom, just like I said, okay? Now hit submit and now watch this happen. It's going to instantly give me, based off of everything that Runway ML suggested I do for my prompt, I'm simply going to get that prompt without having to go through and manually add it myself. So as you look over here on Runway's page, you could see it's going to give you example after example. And, you know, who can keep all of this in the back of their head? So just let ChatGPT do all of the work for you. And that's exactly what we're doing right here. And then there we have it. Check this out. Here's an example of a prompt inspired by the guidance from from Runway Gen 3 Alpha Prompt and Guide. Okay, and now there it is. The perfect keywords that we need. Now, you can use this prompt to generate some fascinating videos. However, this isn't about AI video, but I first just wanted to show you how good of a job this can do. And there we have it. Man, now look at that. That is insanely impressive. But that's not even the main premise of this. Here's the next question you want to ask. And this is where you're really going to 10x your prompts. Okay, thank you. But now this time, make it way more detailed. Just like that. Thank Thanks. Please make it way more detailed. And now you're really going to get some more details for this specific prompt. Now, it's going to be based off of that web page, but here's the thing you want to keep in mind. Since it's going to provide you with all of the correct type of prompts to use, all you have to do to get your specific category or keyword is just replace, like you see right here, a secluded beach. Okay. Just replace some of the most important keywords and replace them with yours instead. So if I didn't want a secluded beach, I could say something like a vibrant future city, but I can still keep all of these important keywords like these adjectives right here, like the frame captures the warm sunlight casting delicate reflections on the water. Okay. So you still can use the important details. Just replace your subject with anything else that you want. And my goodness, this, these are amazing. Look at that image right there. Perfect example on what a good prompt can do and what a good prompt can create for you. I love the way that these turned out. Amazing job. Now, before we move on and I show you this amazing prompt generator, wait until you see this last step. This is going to be amazing based off of any Wikipedia page. So that's exactly where I am. I'm on the specific Wikipedia page for Game of Thrones. You're back in chat GPT. Same thing. What's this page about? paste in the URL of the Wikipedia Game of Thrones, and we're gonna start this process all over. Remember, once we get the basic overview, we're then gonna say, create a prompt. 
And then there it is. It's giving us the full thing. Now watch this. And then here is what I said at the very bottom. Create a prompt to use in AI image generators like Midjourney based off of that page. Now watch this. It's going to give me just that. It's going to create a prompt for Game of Thrones. Now look at that. There it is. Now the cool thing to keep in mind is it gives me just a basic prompt that I could use right here. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and copy it, but I can now say, please add a specific character. Look at this. Please add the character of Amelia Clark in the prompt. Now, while that's waiting and we see what we can get with Amelia Clark, check out this image we were able to get with that first prompt. That's incredible. Let's come back over here and see what we got with Amelia Clark. Look at this epic fantasy scene based off of that Wikipedia page. And then there she is, Amelia Clark. Let's now go ahead and copy this one. We'll head over here in the mid journey, go ahead and paste that in and now see what we can get for this one. Look at these. These are fantastic. But wait until you see the ones I got in mid journey for Amelia Clark as well. And there we have have them. Boom. Look at that. Look how amazing all four of these images look. Fantastic. Remember, simply based off of any single web page. Okay, but now it's time to show you this amazing prompt generator. And so what we're going to do for this one is come over here to my new database, my prompt generators database. Now what this database will do is basically going to allow you to never need prompts again. And I mean that in a literal sense, okay? Because what these generators do, these are all prompt generators with all different end specific specific views, what these actually do, these are prompts or prompt engineers, prompts that generate prompts based off of any subject that you need. Okay. So when I show you this next one right here, let's go ahead and do just that. So I'll go ahead and open up a specific view. That way I could see this prompt specifically. Okay. Now here it is. Go ahead and copy this whole entire thing right here. Okay. It's basically an anything prompt, create a specific prompt for anything that you need, okay? So it's all copied and all these prompts are gonna operate almost the same way that you can get prompt after prompt after prompt without knowing basically anything. Check the links in the description for the best prompts you've ever seen. Okay, now that that prompt is copied, again, let's open up a brand new chat in ChatGPT. Here it is, simply just paste this prompt in. It basically says, I want you to be my prompt creator. Your goal is to help me craft the best possible prompt for my needs. Understood, Eric? Let's get started. What would you like the prompt to be about? Okay, now just start the process. Talk to ChatGPT like you would with a, now just talk to ChatGPT like you would a contractor that you're hiring. I said a storybook with both the text for each chapter along with prompts to generate images based off of that chapter, okay? Here is the first iteration of your prompt. So what it basically does right away, the first portion is always gonna give you just some suggestions. But now here are the actual questions and this is where you need to answer them to get the exact prompt that you want. What's the story's main genre? Okay. What's the audience? Quickly answer these questions. I'm going to say a fantasy world. Okay. Audience is mature. Okay. And I want, um, cinematic and very photorealistic. Okay. Would you prefer each image prompt to include detail elements? Yes. And yes, as much detailed as possible. Okay. IE elements, lighting, cameras, cameras, etc. Okay. And then there we have that. And I'll just say there are five chapters. Okay. There we have it. There is a revised prompt. Okay. Create a storybook set in a fantasy world. It's going to give me more suggestions and then character summaries. I can answer these questions further. If not, I can just say start the process. Okay. Start the process, create the chapters and prompts for the images. Okay. Now you can keep answering the questions back and forth if you want. In fact, that's going to be very helpful if you have the time and you really want to focus in on what you want your storybook to look like. However, remember this is a prompt generator, not just for a storybook. It's a mega prompt generator for basically anything that you want. Okay. And then look right away, it's going to give me chapter one, the awakening in the ancient grove for each chapter. I'm going to get these image prompts. Okay. There we have that one. We come down here for chapter two and then we come down here for chapter three. Pretty good. Okay. So let's go ahead and just start with the first one. Now, remember I could have made this a lot better, but for the first chapter, let's just see how good of a job that this can do. I'm first going to copy this whole entire thing. And now we can do one of two things. I can either copy and paste this prompt as is in mid journey or any other AI tool. Okay. So we'll do just that just to see what this gives us. It's completely random or the other thing we can do is open up a brand new chat, paste it in the chat GPT. And now at the very bottom, say this based off of these details. Okay. Now just give it the details that you need. And I just said, based off of these details, 
Please create 10 prompts for AI images. Include a young woman as the main character. Now remember, when I first did this prompt, I went quickly. I didn't really answer all the questions because one of the questions may have been, who is the main character? But look, based off of this I just got in my other chat, remember, it gave me prompts just in this bullet to text like that. But now in my new one, it's actually given me 10 very good prompts with a new specific character in my for my subject and there we have it again you can copy any of these prompts and then try them for yourself and now let me show you the way these actual images turned out all of these images are incredible but this prompt generator is going to 10x anything that you do you can get it via the link in the description in addition to all these prompts databases i just showed you thank you so much for watching this video if you liked it please make sure to hit that subscribe button